party, you could put together a little treasure chest with the core ingredients we'll use again and again. Let's call it a sunshine kit. If you have got these essentials in your kitchen, Caribbean cooking will be a breeze. Okay. I've put in ginger, which adds heat as well as flavor. How much fee? That's Jamaican dollars, by the way. Old spice or pimento, scotch bonnet pepper, my favorite. These are one of the world's hottest chili peppers. You have any nutmeg there, lady? Lord of mercy, fantastic fresh nutmeg. Next, some sweet scented thyme. I gotta say, this is really fresh stuff, yeah. And finally, a bit of bay leaf. Now in there, I should have everything I need to bring a bit of sunshine to your kitchen. Lots of these flavors go into the most popular fast food in Jamaica, the legendary jerk chicken. You see these oil drum barbecues called jerk pans everywhere across the Caribbean. Jerk has been described as Jamaica's culinary gift to the world and it has a rich history. Jerk is a spicy seasoning rubbed into chicken, pork, fish or pretty much anything. The cooking method is said to have been used by Jamaica's original inhabitants, the Arawak Indians, who laid their meat on pimento wood strips in a fire pit, perhaps the world's first barbecue. You know, jerk is not just about how you cook it, it's the spices that you use and what you put in it. So today, I'm gonna make my sticky jerk wings with sugared oranges. This is first-rate finger food, a modern twist on traditional jerk flavors. I have kept the spice, but added a delicious sweetness with honey. A fantastic accompaniment are these sugared orange slices, which are caramelized on the barbecue. First, I'm gonna need four spring onions. Get rid of the ugly bits. Just chop them roughly, because I am gonna put them in a pestle and mortar. Next, I'm gonna plunder that fabulous Caribbean sunshine kit. Two tablespoonful of thyme leaves. So I'm not gonna chop these, I'm just gonna flake off the leaves. One scotch bonnet pepper, and I'm gonna choose a red one. You know, scotch bonnet pepper is always optional. Jerk is not about the heat. It's about the flavors of the spices that you put together. A knob of ginger and chop that up finely. Then I'm gonna put all this lot into a pestle and mortar. There are two kinds of seasoning for jerk. The first one is what you call dry seasoning. But then you have the wet rub, which is what I'm gonna make. I'm gonna add 100 mils of cider vinegar, one teaspoonful of cinnamon, three tablespoonful of honey, Next, I'm gonna add pimento or allspice. Two tablespoonful of olive oil. Add a bit of salt and pepper, mash it up, and then transfer it to a bowl. The sweetness and the spices are a lip-smacking combination. Wow. I've got some really fresh chicken wings here. I'm gonna pop them in. It's good to leave these for about four hours to marinate, but better still overnight. But you know what? I've got some already prepared. I've made myself a little barbecue here, just as I would as a little boy. Nothing fancy, have a look. <laughs> Once you've put them on the barbecue, turn them every couple of minutes or so. This stunning spot happens to be a sugar plantation. Sugar has long been a core crop in Jamaica, and I'm serving my sticky jerk chicken wings with sugared orange slices. Quarter your oranges, and coat them generously in the sugar. Yeah, I know, it's exciting. I think you can see where I'm going with this. Add the oranges, sugared side down. And once they get browned, you just turn them over. These are so easy, but so delicious. Have a go on your barbecue. And now, to round the day off, a little local spectacle burning the cane. In preparation for the harvesters, the cane field is set on fire to clear away all the leftover brushwood, leaving just the cane stalks. There's nothing like dinner by the fire. 